shine your radiance. April 22, 2015 Greetings, I am Master Lanto, greeting you from afar, yet right next to you in your field of light if you allow me. I wish to speak to you about radiance. Radiance is comprised of many things. Exalt within your own radiance, for it is the spark that drives your soul. It is you in your essential form. It is all that is. You are awash in your own radiance when you bow to yourself and accept all that is you in its purest form, love. Loving yourself and accepting yourself is key, as you well know. But do you live it day in and day out, moment by moment, in the now? Every flaw, every obstacle, every struggle, every seeming impediment of your happiness, is indeed only love attempting to take hold on the deeper level of you. And this brings us to your core, your essence. Do you think that it is devoid of radiance just because you encounter unhappy times, or struggles? No, it is radiance waiting to be revealed and embraced and accepted by you. Dear ones, I cannot stress enough to you that you are radiance in full glory when you allow yourselves to be so. It is as simple as that, and as complex as that. And while that may appear to be a paradox, consider this. Have you noticed that just looking at something with a certain attitude will color it with that attitude? You all know this. So why not color everything with your joy, with your peace, with your love, with your exaltedness, your bubbling effervescent spark, your radiance, lying under the surface of all that judgment and skewing of the fact that you are all essentially pure and radiant, for you are a child of God, of Creator, all that is, however you wish to term it. Take that concept now, and envelop and embrace it within you now. Look at your feelings about yourself right now. Look at your environment right now. What do you feel slash see? Be honest. Now consider what that seeming reality would be if you accepted that you are the divine, and that all around you is a projection of the divine. What would it look slash feel like now? It is different, is it not? You see, when you accept that you are as much of the divine that Creator is, as much of the divine as Yeshua, as Jesus, when He walked the earth, or any of the Ascended Masters are, you begin to fan the flame of your divinity even more, so that it takes over your reality as you see it now. This shift is called enlightenment, and you can have it now. You do have it now by accepting and basking in the radiance that is you, the spark of your divine essence become manifest. What douses your divine flame is your judgment, is your doubt, and is your fear that you could be as radiant as all the ascended masters and archangels are, as Creator is. You are, dear ones. So shine, dear ones, shine your radiance in everything you do and think and say, and I will be with you in counterpart as you lift from the struggles of everyday life, only a signpost to the destination of becoming fully engorged in radiance. I leave you with a prayer to help you in this endeavor. Divine Self, I am Presence, grant me the pleasure of knowing you in full. Grant me the pleasure of being my guiding light in everything I do, in everything I see, in everything I experience. For Thou is the glory that resides within me. It is in no other place. I am the Divine. I am the Radiance. Allow it to emerge more fully with each breath I take with each step I take, with each struggle I encounter, and with each endeavor I attempt. And let it be known that all shall be colored with this divine radiance that I am, forever and always. And so it is. So beloveds, remember I hold you in the highest esteem. Your radiance draws me to you and allows me to share my love and radiance, allowing your days to be filled with all the light that you can hold. Namaste. I am Master Lanto, in fullness of radiance, as are you. Channeled by Fran Zepeda. www.franhealing.com www.franheal.wordpress.com www.ouremergingdivinity.com